great, beautiful, rising to all my king, queen, gods, and goddesses. It is your boy, Terrible One Star. Got to break it down to all my beautiful Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, and Venus, or wherever it is that in your chart, okay? Now, this is a disclaimer. This is a general reading. Take it as it resonates. If it resonates for you, make sure you hit that like, comment, subscribe, and share button. If not, hey, I try to do the best that I can for you, okay? So with that basically being said, let's go ahead and get into it. Virgo, the title of this one is Somebody See Your Beauty somebody see your beauty and they want to tie you down okay somebody see your beauty and they want to tie you down so virgo i feel like your energy that you are carrying right now is very very charming very alluring and everybody see you for how you are they see the way that you move is very graceful you are very kind-hearted genuine individual and now if somebody here is trying to come in to tie you down, now there's two situations in this. One is trying to tie you down for something good, and somebody may be coming in your life to try to get you go through a reoccurring cycle again, okay? However, this is the right time for you to do what's best for you, okay? Now, someone around you, <coughs> forgive me, someone around you may be uh, following their intuition or maybe trying to walk out of a situation and get to you. Now, Virgo. I feel like you are leaving the old and coming into a new as well. But this person that you are dealing with, they know that you genuine. They know you pure. They know you try to walk in the best innocent. But you also know how to invest your time wisely. And they see the greatness in you. And they truly want to start a union with you. Now, so you separated from some, somebody want to come back in good graces, okay? Now, Virgo, you may not want this emotional union with anyone at the moment because you've been drained and you've been so bored for people not applying themselves the way that they need to apply themselves in your life, Virgo. And I feel like it could be dealing with some type of mixed emotions. Something may be blocked or someone messed up some type of situation where the information that they were getting on you, uh, now they're trying to find a way to push in farther. Now, not only that, I feel like your intuition know what's good for you and what's not good for you. And right now, you are going with your inner knowing to go through the changes instead of being distracted from people who always normally distract you off of your course, okay, Virgo? Now, now, I also feel like now it may be mixed emotions dealing with a twin flame that you may be dealing with and now you are trying to walk away and move on and you are letting go instead of trying to find any more information about a person being fake or a person wearing a mask or anything like that. Right now you are being distracted or somebody's trying to distract you from the delays to push for it, forgive me, because you're not finding the truth or honesty that you need. Now, I feel like, are you walking up a ladder with somebody? Yes, you are taking the time out that you need to understand the lessons that you need to understand in your life in order to be emotionally, in order to not be emotionally out of control dealing with past life situations or past situations. Now, even though you are taking the time out, you are starting to understand people who is unreliable, people who's not putting in effort, even though you are being strong about a situation, Virgo, I feel like right now, you are being strong about people who being deceitful, disloyal, you also being uh, sure about people that you got to protect yourself from, and I feel like that is very important for you as well. Now, someone from the past want to come in, Virgo, to make a resolution to start something with you, okay? Now, again, your beauty is alluring, your energy is wonderful, and people see this. Exes see it and want to come back into play, and new people see it want to come in and give you new opportunities. Now, with that basically being said, let's go ahead and pray and meditation. Spirit, guys, angel, universe, we thank you right now for everybody coming to the channel. Lead us, guide us, give us the blueprint and the understanding towards our highest good, highest expectations. Now, anybody wishing the ill will mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, or emotionally, what we're going to do, we're going to send that energy back to the universe universe and abundance of love instead of the sender. I shame. I shame. Amen. All right, Virgo, let's go ahead and get into this. We had to do a little pre-shuffle right quick just to see what was going on with the energy during the uh, downloads. Now, right now we're going to work on breath, okay? It's going to help you with ease, boundaries, and immunity. Now, it releases allergy and nasal congestion, assists immune system, but it opens direct breath from the head to sinuses. Hmm. Forgive me. Virgo, don't be tired on yourself. Don't give up on yourself, okay? Now, bring the tip of the index fingers to touch the base of the thumbs. Touch the tip of the thumb to the top of the middle finger. Allow all the other fingers to extend outward. Rest the backs of the hands and the top of the thighs, palms facing up. So what we're going to work on on this one, Virgo, I, I sense it open to perfect balance and breath. I sense and open to perfect balance and breath. Now, shout out to my A1 Day Ones. This is what we do right now. We breathe in positive energy, let out all the negative so we can get the downloads properly that God want to give us or the universe want to give us to receive, okay? Now, breathe in. Positive energy, positive light, full abundance to your highest good and understanding. Now, hold it. 
and release out all the negativity, all the stress, all the worries, all the doubts, all the concerns, anything that's not suitable for you, let it go back to the universe. Very good. Breathe in. Positive energy, positive light, full abundance to your highest good and understanding. Now hold it. And release out all the negativity, all the stress, all the worries, all the doubts, all the concerns. Anything that's not suitable for you, very good. Breathe in. I sense it open to perfect balance and breath. I sense it open to perfect balance and breath. Now hold it. I sense it open to perfect balance and breath. Release. I sense it open to perfect balance and breath. I say. I say. I mean, all right, let's go ahead and get into this to see what's going on with the Virgo. Spirit guys in the universe, we thank you right now for everybody coming to the channel, especially Cross Watcher. Lead us, guide us, give us a good turn to understanding towards our highest good and highest expectations. Now, anybody wish any ill will mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, emotionally, we're going to send that to the universe in abundance of love. I say, I say. Our man. All right, Virgo. Spirit guys in the universe. What do we have for Virgo? Sun, moon, rising, north, north, and Venus when it comes to somebody seeing their beauty. What do the, what do people see in Virgo? I say. What else do Vir people see in Virgo? Or what does this person see with Virgo? Give me one more. Thank you. What you don't see coming right now, it may be some type of demands that you need to make through in order to push forward into your life. And Virgo, that is very beautiful. Right now, we got the King of Wands basically being up as your main energy. So we got Leo, Sagittarius, Aries that you could be dealing with. This could be dealing with your actions, your willpower, your inspiration, or anything that it comes to you dealing with love, okay? Yeah, I feel like right now you being more of an entrepreneur, you being uh, more of an innovator to start something new to something that you're more compassionate about. Now, I feel like you may be doing this because you had to go back and look at all the past. Now, if it's dealing with a relationship, you had to go look at your past relationships to see where you are today. So I feel like the person that may be trying to come in, this new person, probably see your value and probably see your growth. However, I feel like right now, Virgo, you may not be sliding into anybody's picture right now because in order for you to get this perfect love of this perfect balance that you need Virgo I feel like right now you had to allow the wheels to turn instead of trying to be mentally inside your head about people gossiping about you or people trying to give information and news about you Virgo I feel like you have fully stopped to think before you react instead of the hanging on the situations that's no longer suitable for you now I also feel like the choice that you are making you are stamping down between the stability that you want to make in your life and right now you are getting to understand to take the courage and strength that you need in order to push forward now I also feel like your healing with the Queen of Cups may be a little vulnerable right now or the healing aspect on your voyage may be very uh, a new type of energy that you may be carrying. So you got to think before you react about any type of situation. OK, Virgo. Now, the King of Wands basically being up right is clarified by the Ace of Wands basically being in reverse to Judgment basically being in reverse. And we also got the Three of Wands up right. So I feel like you looking back from all the things that you have went through in your past. Right. You have went through all the time to go through the self-nourishment and the self-growth to find yourself the way you need to with the king of wands basically being upright so i feel like since you done went back you done been in the darkness you done been through hell you done been through the pain you done been through turmoil you done been through people playing you you done been through people manipulating over you you done been through it all virgo and right now since you are so tired of going through all of that you decide to work on yourself and now what's going on you with the eight of wands basically being upright clarified by the peace card i feel like you're finding peace and solution finding peace and clarity into anything that's not suitable for you anymore i feel like if you was confused about the way how you want to move i feel like now you are starting to sacrifice yourself and ask spirit to help you dealing with unreliable people. Now, the poor decisions that you made that may be challenging, I feel like right now you are starting to think before you react in a situation when it comes to people that's trying to manipulate you, and especially trying to use love uh, uh, use the love tactic in order to get over uh, on you in order to keep you mentally bound down or mentally tied down. Now Virgo now it's another aspect of you. you overcoming over the fears from your past right you looking out, you making plans and now you're trying to expand yourself with some type of new starting point. However ooh, forgive me However, it may be somebody that's close to you right now, Virgo, that's trying to win at all costs. But I feel like you seeing the clarity and everything that you need to do to be more in tune with your emotions. And now your spiritual gifts and your intuition is kicking in with you when it comes to these people. Now, somebody see, they know you very intuitive. They know you very emotional. And they know they cannot get over on you. And they know every time that you come into play or something that you go through, something new, and it comes out to be better. So I feel like this person know you're an empath.
path. This person know you very patient, but this person also know you like to flow and the new opportunities are coming in. You very wise and very smart. However, with this person, they realize right now judgment is always going to be in your favor because you're a divine person, okay? Now, this person may be trying not to heal and go through the healing process because right now they also trying to figure out a situation to let things go themselves in order to do the healing as well. Now, I feel like right now, Three of Cups basically being in reverse, I feel like they may be disappointed or incubated over something that they put on a pedestal, something that they need to understand. Now, I also understand, Virgo, you looking at people as toxic right now. So you may not be want to jump in any type of situation right now. I feel like with healing, you want to take the time to do the healing that you need in order to grow, in order to get to your mastery of emotions. Now, even though the poor choices may be challenging, dealing with people that may be egotistical, may be trying to gossip behind your back, the ones that's being manipulative and sneaky, the thing about it is you found your balance emotionally not to let people even interfere. Now, people may be greedy or tr untrustworthy, and you know that, and what you've done, you had to close the door on those to overcome over the odds dealing with yourself. Now, even though you overcoming over the tension, you're overcoming and you expanding, you trying to do something greater, dealing with the stability and dealing with your growth. Some of you may be want to go back to school, but whoever this person that you may be dealing with that's on the end that's trying to come back from the past, yes, I feel like they're trying to win at all costs. They realize now that without you, they are very stressed out and worried. Now they feel like isolated and rejected and alone, and they're trying to find a new way to identify everything that's going on in this healing process since you done took time away. Now, they know you may be happy since you've been away. Now, do they feel the same way? No. But I feel like right now, in order to start this new cycle, they're going to have to face their fears and look inside the mirror within themselves and actually heal their heart the same way how you've been healing yours. Now, I feel like this new person that may be trying to come in, yes, they see a spark and they will express themselves with you. However, they feel isolated, sad, and rejected because whatever that they going through led them down the wrong road for this new opportunity. However, their tensions may be rising with somebody and now they may be going through the dark night of the soul or going through some healing process to reheal their heart from the heart, from the things that they've done to you. I feel like it's been reciprocated by the universe, okay? Now, not only that, Virgo, I also see the more that you go in isolation, the more you regather yourself again, okay? The more you put yourself back in harmony the way that it needs to be. There's no more confusion about what you want with peace, and there's no more uh, conflicts dealing with anybody who cannot express themselves the way they want to. Virgo, it's coming in somebody, it's like you leaving away from one old person, and somebody's gonna come in and match everything that you really need in your life. When I say a soulmate, this is a divine mate. This is not a karmic lesson. I feel like you have learned a karmic lesson dealing with certain peoples and certain individuals. However, I feel like right now the, the process has been too slow for you to see any profit or any gain when it comes to people who have belittled you or anybody who has hurt you, okay? Now, let's go ahead and keep going and see what else that we have. All right. Spirit guys and the universe. And make sure y'all hit that like, comment, subscribe button as well, okay? Let's see what we got for Virgo. This, this one came out. So I feel like right now, again, you may be on a voice that it's a new voice that you are on. But Virgo, you got to think before you react. Now, even though you are starting to move in, in some type of situation, again, with the King of Wands basically being upright, clarified by the two, uh, Ten of Pentacles upright, just letting me know you are looking back from all the accolades that you have went through. And now you want to start something new. You want to build You want to build something that's really in longevity. Now, you want to be with somebody that's going to love you the way that you, that you want to be loved. And however, with you moving forward into your life, somebody is frustrated that you leaving them behind. I feel like now this is old energy that I'm feeling with this card right here. So I feel like somebody for your past may be trying to come back into play. But what's challenging for you, Virgo, every time you get around a certain individual, or every time you get around a person, right now you be trying to find a resolution because they always trying to win at all costs. But when they do this, or when you try to turn around and get emotionally invested with something that's not good for you, Virgo, it always take you out of your element. It always block you from spirituality, and it always block you from yourself from seeing the real picture. Now, even though you empathic enough and you are starting to rebuild yourself, Virgo, okay? Now, emotionally, you rebuilding yourself, you doing the self-love. Some of you may not be taking people uh, for, uh, you may not be taking yourself for granted or you may not be looking at people the same way like you used to. I feel like some of you are finally mastering the way how to control your emotions to not do that thing. Okay, excuse me. Now, also, I want to tell you now, somebody know I like to read the four agreements, right? That was a great book. If you want to see the audio book, 
watch the uh, listen to the audio book. But it tell you rule number one: the word is impeccable. And what that basically means, even though you put in a lot of hard work and you always put in a lot of hard work when it comes to people trying to manipulate you, trying to be trickery, trying to cheat, trying to do all of this stuff to hold you back from the recognition that you deserve, it's just because you got to go through an old and get to the new. Okay, now don't feel sad, isolated, and rejected because maybe the words that you may be hearing that people may be giving you, Virgo, maybe uh, you may be taking it personally. That's what we had a reading yesterday said, don't take nothing personal. Get your heart off your sleeve. So I feel like with all the isolated, sad, and rejection that you feel, I feel like it's dealing with irreliable people that you need, you, that you know you need to move forward from because right now it's suppressing your energy, suppressing your emotions. Now, I feel like you need to take the time to withdraw. Take time to see things for how they are, but continue to be that inspirational, compassionate person that you are. Continue to put in the action that you need with this new starting point and put in the effort to get away from anybody who's manipulative, that's deceiving, who always like to put you in third party situations, who always like to cheat, who always like to do sneaky stuff behind your back. And I feel like you're realizing you got to let it go. Now, I feel like majority of you with these people, you start to work on grounding, even if it's a love situation because you don't want any conflicts. However, it's still creating a lot of anxiety and a lot of stress and a lot of doubts and concern because this person may not be pouring into you the way that it needs to pour to them for, in order for this love to kindle. Now, I feel like now you looked at both sides of the situation and now you realizing you need to strengthen your emotions. You need to strengthen yourself in order to pursue to yourself towards, towards away from them people that's manipulating you. Yes, there's still people around you doing the same old thing and don't get mad at them, Virgo. We got to get mad at ourselves for allowing this. We keep allowing poor decisions to come in our life and then when we express about it, we got to allow the wheels to turn, but we get the clarity and truth that we need, okay, Virgo? Now, I also want to say right now, with the King of Wands basically being in reverse as your main theme, even though you're looking for stability, somebody, uh, maybe you no longer want to try to keep working on something, or you no longer running away from it, you accepting it for the way that it is. Now, even though you're moving forward, but when t people tensions start to spark up, or attitudes get in the way, you see something unexpected and shocking dealing with somebody that you used to have lust for, okay? Now, Spirit also wanted to want me to tell you the uh somebody trying to Oh, excuse me. Somebody trying to come in with a second chance and try to make an amends with you, but in the resolution field about it, somebody's still trying to win at all costs. They know the order to bring peace and harmony into your life, they got to let you be free. They got to stop blocking you from spirit, stop blocking you from intuition. Now, your energy, uh, your emotions that you carry is very, you may be feeling vulnerable or you may be very empathic dealing with trying to build with people because it's hard for you to build because whatever negative mindset that a person has put on you or whatever conflicted energy, it's created a lot of unsure energy when it comes to building with one another. Now, Virgo, I feel like right now you are no longer putting any hard work and dwelling about the past. You are allowing things to be because you're working on self-nourishment and self-focus and self-growth and you are building yourself instead of allowing you know people to manipulate you from chasing the thrill with them and they always give you fair results or hesitancy. Now, Spirit also want me to tell you right now, Virgo, even though you may feel like people are unreliable with the page of let me make sure it's right. With the Knight of Cups basically being in reverse, you got to start investing emotionally into yourself. And I feel like when you didn't and you wanted somebody to do that to you, with uh, I feel like your ego or you may have been cutting through a lot of situations that you may have been hanging on to. The reason why is because you know you had to move forward. Like this this journey that you on, Virgo, yes, you got your ancestors protecting over you. You will receive the victory that you need. However, it's still some warnings and delays that you need to learn the lesson cycle, the learning the life lesson cycles dealing with people that you love. Yes, when you receive your vic victory, yes, you're going to have a harmonious balance come in for you, okay? The love that you need going to come in. You're going to start loving yourself the right way that you need to. And then the healing that you're going through, you're going to start putting action on it. Right now, you need to identify the problems that is at hand with you, that's stopping you from this uh, recognition, that's stopping you from your victory, that's stopping you from this full chemistry to give you that y what y'all need for this full abundance to grow. Now, Virgo, again, you're starting to uh, give a second chance on yourself to find peace and balance. But instead of being confused, Virgo, I feel like right now you're taking your perspective to be better off finding the happiness that you need and you are closing doors while you are walking away. Now, again, if somebody coming from the old trying to come back in, I feel like you ain't got no word from them. I feel like you solid. It's no more stonewalling. I think you done made up the mind that you need to make. Uh, you rather focus on yourself. You might rather focus on not the family, but you focus on bringing family within your home. You're working on loving yourself. You are working on bonding 
around dealing with the things that's more sensual and confiding to you instead of dealing with conflicts and incompatibilities, dealing with people that always want to prove a point with nothing to be proved. Virgo, it's possibilities out there for you, Virgo. Keep your mind clear. Take that risk. Do what you need to do. Start seeing that happiness within yourself again as you are because you are charming. You are graceful. Again, you kind-hearted. People see you this way. Now, also, somebody, again, want to see you trapped, tied down, stuck. They want to keep you stuck from the possibilities that you may be going through or somebody may be trying to control over you. Virgo, it's time to release and heal yourself from the peace that you really need from within. Like, bring that peace out of you, Virgo. Now, the self-growth, because everybody who's dealing with you right now, they're going through karma. If anybody ever treated you wrong or anybody, and like this may be some information you don't know. Somebody could have treated you dirty. Somebody could have treated you unfairly, but you made the judgment not to not to try to react or retaliate on somebody, and this is why good karma is coming your way. Spirit also want me to tell you, it's time to take that genuine leap of faith away from those that's been manipulating you, the ones that give you shocking unevents because the lustful energy that may be around. So Virgo, I feel like right now you understood the mistakes that you are going through in your life. You understood to be sharp and be strong-minded and find the clarity that you need when it comes to the lovers or coming to a loving type of situation where somebody that you care about that always manipulates you and take you down the wrong road, okay? Now, Spirit Guys Angel Universe, what do we have for... Mm. Right now, Virgo, even though love may be on the horizon for you, or even though that's what you're looking for, you still got to understand the lessons at the task at hand. Once you understand the lessons and realize the disappointments that you had to go through in order to grow towards your wish fulfillment, you will stop having that lack of starting point, that lack of commitment, and start being that independent vessel that you are. Now, people still may be, be manipulative and trying to sneak behind your back, but you know these people out here for beneficial gain, you starting to express yourself around old past people that you being frustrated on, and right now you've been strategic to walk in a beautiful light. Yes, emotionally, you are unstable right now because you're not getting the things that you want, but you're learning the lessons from people that you put on a pedestal, from poor choices that you made that made you feel isolated, sad, and rejected, and that brought this tower moment. Now, I feel like you're finding a resolution again from this person that's trying to win at all costs, but I feel like a new person coming in very empathic, but you got to identify the problem within yourself. Stop juggling with something that's not good for you and adapt to make that change that you need to be that in that in Nah, that inspirational individual that you need away from toxicity and away from toxic people. Now, I feel like the changes that you are making emotionally, yeah, you may can change the grief and sorrow from all the third party situations of people sneaking and all the heavy burdens that they try to get you to hold. Now, you let me go. you no longer dealing with the stress. You're no longer dealing with expanding and dealing with temperature, uh, with attitudes and things that's trying to rise that's not trying to rise fast enough. Now, if you, I feel like right now, Virgo, like, Someone see your energy being this great, harmonious earth angel, okay? However, they don't want to do the work. They know being with an earth angel, they got to put in a lot of work when it comes towards their happiness and coming towards their stability in order for it to grow. It's not just going to be a one-sided street. But I feel like, Virgo, the more you express yourself, the more you start to block yourself from intuition and block yourself um, from spirit and spirits trying to show you about this person. Or this may be a person that don't want to grow and don't want to do the work. However, while you still being in peace and abundance and interflowing with yourself towards your true happiness, okay? Now, I feel like somebody arrogance is stopping the wheels from turning because somebody have not understood the poor decisions that they made to progress and see the light clearly. Somebody's not taking the time out, Virgo, to see you for how they how you truly are. Instead, they looking at poor choices from the past to trying to change the way from their stability, from being in the darkness to being in the light, from being in poverty to be starting being successful. So they use any means necessary to keep you tracked down and try to get, get you to chase them high Ever, you seen a wiser solution when it came to this and you looking at all the stuff that you poured into now if it's dealing with the past you are no longer dealing with it because you rather ground instead of being in a non-healing process non-healing state dealing with people who are non-committal and don't want to help you grow okay Virgo now I feel like again you follow your intuition dealing with anything where any resolution is needed to be made you pulling out people mass again you know who pretending and who not and now you decide to walk on your own light spirit want me to tell you to close this off don't get distracted again about the delays about the changes that people are just trying to do, but instead find the truth and honesty within a person. Again, the word is impeccable. What somebody say to you, don't allow it to enter inside your mind. Yes, you can look at it. Yes, you can talk about it. Yes, you can even explain, but don't let it intercept inside to your mental uh, aspect because as above, so below. So if somebody bringing words or uh, spellings to you, which is magic, 
Make sure you receive the right magic. Make sure you receive the good energy of the aspect instead of hanging on to something for greed or something that's no longer suitable for you. And I feel like they're hanging on to you, Virgo. But right now, the ideas that you have, you don't have any new ideas with this person because the person is naive and immature, okay? Now, again, look at where you came from. Start being an innovator again. You done started over before and built an amazing empire. It's okay to start over again to build one. So I feel like some of y'all letting go of the old, starting with some of the new. You're starting to get the understanding about the toxic they are understanding about the blind about people trying to be blindfolded to do sneaky things behind your back. Spirit also wanted to tell you whatever third party situation or whatever truth that came into play, get the understanding to know what's going on when it comes to past people because they're the one who do it to you the most, okay? Now, one more thing. Now, don't be feeling demand about the action that you need to take. Understand the lesson, understand the truth, learn from it overcome it, and then stop tapping your emotions into people that's, that's not suitable for you, okay, Virgo? So, with that basically being said, let's go ahead and work on our first one. I experience joy in all areas of my life, and this raises my vibrations. I experience joy in all areas of my life, and this expresses, this raises my vibrations, forgive me. Now, the other one is, I am open to receiving all the love in the universe. I am open to receiving all the love in the universe. I say, I say, I say. Now, the other one is for your spiritual development. I am a being of divine light full of unlimited potential. I am a being of divine light full of unlimited potential. I say, I say, I say. And the last one is I attract more money than I need. I attract more money than I need. I say, I say, I mean. Now, with that basically being said, Virgo, y'all already know what to do. Somebody see your beauty. Two people, somebody see the real side of you. Somebody see the real, the growth in you. And right now, somebody's still trying to go through the old situation that's trying to hang on to you because they see the beneficial gain in you. Now, Virgo, do you see, do you put this person on a pedestal? No. You see the options and you are very cautious about people around you. And you no longer want to do anything about pouring all your energy into people that don't want to reciprocate it back. Now, somebody is spying on you, Virgo. Virgo. Somebody's trying to get information on how to come back in your good graces. But I feel like by you letting go and moving on and releasing this situation, the only one who can stop you is you. But I feel like new opportunity is coming in with the choices that you need to make in your life in order to let go. Some of you are doing a life-changing event and finally going through things that's best suitable for you because you no longer want to be controlled, dealing with emotional aspects with people. You want a harmonious balance that's 50-50. And if you can't get that Virgo, I feel like majority of y'all are walking away from situations. Now, Peace, love, and light, light, love, and peace. If you want a personal reading, we'll be in the description box below. So text me, get at me. We can set up an appointment. We can make that happen. So I just want to say, I love you. God love you. Universe love you. Make sure you love yourself. That's the most important thing. Peace, love, and light, light, love, and peace. Till I see y'all beautiful souls till the next time. I say, I say, I'm man, baby. Yep. Yeah.